how to create nfts on OpenSea mobile hi guys welcome back to another video and in this video i'm going to be telling you how you can create your nfts right here on your mobile phone and all you're going to need are two are things so having said that let's just jump into it so first things first let me just tell you these two applications right here so first things first we're going to need the application for open seas and we're going to need the application for metamask right and over here just simply search for these two applications so go on this application right here this is the icon and just simply install it if you search for metamask this is the application right here and this is how it looks like it's really easy it's really simple and once you've downloaded them you can go ahead and begin your project so it's really simple let's go ahead and open up open seas now this is a pretty amazing application right here now over here you have a bunch of different options you have as you can see some already created you know categories you have arts music domain name you know trading cards and all these stuff then you have some notable drops over here that are just been created which i think are pretty cool so this is the official walking dead this is like daryl's motorcycle over here which i think is pretty cool i always like that bike yeah let's move on so anyway over here at the bottom you have your home you have your stats you have your search you have your profile you have your more now how do you upload the nft so you don't really use this application to upload nfts you only use it to view your nft and to connect your you know and to connect your metamask wallet account so how do you upload them it's very simple what you're going to do is you're going to go back and you're going to open up metamask account it's really simple it's really easy we're going to be using metamask to upload our nfts and because metamask has a browser function over here we're going to go ahead and access the browser and upload our nfts it's really simple it's really easy so as you can see i've opened up my account and i'm already logged in so i don't have to sign in but into your metamask account and once you've done that this is how it's going to look like this is going to be your account you have your address over here then you have your bunch of different options where you can buy send or swap some cryptocurrencies if you want and you're going to have your nfts stored here as well so over here click on the hamburger menu at the top left corner you're going to have a bunch of different options so you have you on ether scan you have activity if you click on activity you can see all of your transactions over here but as you can see this is a brand new account i have no transactions whatsoever so let's go ahead and jump into it and go ahead and upload our nft so again we're going to go over here and click on the browser app option over here as you can see we click on browser it's going to open up the browser and i've already you know opened up open seas so what you're going to do is you're going to go over here and just simply search for open seas you know it's going to give you a bunch of different options so over here just simply choose this option right here this is the website that you want to go over to and over here this is how it's going to look like so it's completely normal don't worry about it it's really easy so make sure you watch this video until the end and you'll know exactly how to upload nfts from your mobile device so as you can see we are now on the website all we have to do now is connect our you know metamask account so simply click on create or click on these three buttons and over here click on account and over here you can go ahead and log out i've already logged in so let me just go ahead and log out real quick there you go i'm now logged out and we go ahead and refresh this i can't well we'll just leave it at that so let me just go ahead and reload the tab real quick there you go now if i come over here i don't have the option over here but i have the connect wallet option so i'm simply going to go ahead and click on connect wallet and i'm going to choose metamask since we are already using metamask application it should be very easy we choose metamask wait a couple of seconds and it'll automatically connect as you can see over here so now we have our wallet connected we are logged into OpenSea. now all that is left for us to do is just simply create our nft so over here click on the create option right here it's going to open up your account over here just simply sign the transaction to accept the open seas terms and services so simply click on sign it's going to load up and it's going to take you over here onto this page where you just simply have to create an nft so over here you just simply have to upload your image video audio or 3d model whichever it may be simply click on the this icon and just choose your image in, from your gallery so i'm going to go ahead and do that so i believe my images were in pictures over here in nft so over here as you can see we have a bunch of different ones so over here we can choose whichever one you want so i'm going to choose this one and i'm going to click on ok and boom there you go we have our nft uploaded now all now all that is left for us to do is just enter in the name so the name of this nft is crypto punk i'm gonna call it red and because it has a red hat or whatever you know i think it looks like a hat i created it then 
over here you have your external link over here the, what this is is basically a link where people can go ahead and see all of your projects so it's basically where you upload a link to showcase all of your project your past projects your future products your current projects the ones you're working on all of that you can over here add in the link so that people can see but if you want to leave it blank it all depends on you and then you have your description you can go ahead and add anything over here like you know it doesn't really matter it's just description just describe your nft and then you have your low collection option so over here you just simply select a collection that you have already created if not you can leave it blank it doesn't really matter and then you have your properties over here what it basically means is over here you will have to input in some properties of your nft i mean you don't have to but if you want to you can so for example if like you are uploading a large collection of nfts then some of these nfts might be some rare nfts like some might have a different background or have a different colored hat or glasses or any other accessory what you're going to do is just simply add in the type of what it is and then add in the color so for example uh let's say that my this nft has a different colored hat so i'm going to add in hat over here and i'm going to call it over here red in the name and then click on save so as you can see red hat or hat red that's how it basically is going to look like and then down below you have your supply now you can technically change the supply but you're going to have to you know change the blockchain now you have two options in front of you so you have either ethereum or polygon both of which have their own pros and cons but if you choose ethereum you're going to have to pay gas fees for the first two times when uploading an nft but on the plus side you will be exposed to a bigger market and a more popular ethereum coin and you might even earn a little bit more money over here whereas if you choose polygon you won't have to pay any gas fee whatsoever it's fast it's free but the downside is that maybe you won't be able exposed to a larger market i mean compared to ethereum polygon is a small cryptocurrency i mean they both run on ethereum network but still you know and you understand what i mean but it all depends on your personal preference they're both really really good and provide their own you know services as well but so for this reason i'm going to choose polygon and over here as you can see you can increase the number of supply of for the each nft that you want so i'm going to keep it at one and then i'm going to simply click on create and give it a few seconds and then you're going to have to you know uh finish up this captcha so let me just go ahead and clear this didn't work this is the chimney verify boom there we go so now as you can see it says your nft has been created so it's really nice it's really good so as you can see over here you created CryptoPunk red so you can go ahead and share this with your friends and family members down below on twitter facebook or you know you can copy the link directly and copy it paste it on your social media or whatever after that all you have to do is just simply sell this nft now to sell this nft over here you will simply click on the sell option and it's going to take you over here and over here just simply enter in the amount of nft and select the duration and once you've done that just simply click on complete listing and boom you are good to go so that is how you basically do it that is how you you know up create nfts on your phone that is how you create NFTs on OpenSeas directly from your phone. So if you have any questions, let me know in the comment sections down below and I'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible. So having said that, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe to our channel and turn on post notifications. And having said that, I will catch you guys in the next video. And until then, take care and goodbye.